Okay, Zakum Allah khair, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulullah. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help us, uh, give us the strength, all of us inshallah, to overcome this test and uh, hopefully inshallah by the end of it, get closer to him inshallah and serve our people and humanity at large inshallah. Um, just a, a quick, quick introduction, the Muslim uh, Charities Forum is a network of uh, Muslim uh, INGOs and uh, recently we start working also with NGOs which basically uh, two parts. One is responding to international emergencies and, and, and the development. And now uh, our colleagues who are also responding to uh, UK uh, social action or needs, as we call it. Uh, uh, it was established in basically like, over, over 12 years ago now. And uh, we have uh, most of the, like, the big charities, alhamdulillah, on board. Uh, the objective is basically uh, create dialogue, uh, encourage uh, cooperation. Uh, we focus on research, uh, advocacy as well as uh, capacity building within uh, the sector. Uh, we came together um, uh, recently to respond to this uh, crisis as a part of the national Muslim response, uh, which is at the moment uh, coordinated and chaired by the Muslim Council of Britain. Um, and the, probably some of you know, they, have, they are different working groups under this. Uh, and we uh, lead on the charities and the Muslim response uh, or the Muslim community response uh, working group. Uh, we are currently, we're doing a uh, what we call it a uh, a mapping exercise. has been going on for now over ten days uh, to capture uh, all the working, uh, all the community and uh, groups and charities who are responding uh, responding to 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 this crisis. Um, so far, we managed to to capture around seventy different, uh, alhamdulillah, uh, organizations and groups. Uh, across the country who are responding uh, locally and um, most of our uh, national and international charities also they're responding uh, and doing alhamdulillah some amazing work uh, the key to all this response is is going to be uh, local uh, local is going to be a challenge for all of us due to the restrictions of movement uh, and of course um, uh, what we call it uh, the protection of our staff and volunteers uh, in general um, uh, we currently, uh, we just uh, on Friday, alhamdulillah, we, something we've been working on, which is the first ever uh, a national emergency appeal uh, to be coordinated among uh, Muslim charities and groups. And uh, we basically uh, have, uh, uh, we launched on Friday, which was more, more like a soft launch uh, with the support of all the umbrella organizations uh, from like a moral support. Uh, and we hope, inshallah, through this, uh, we, if we raise resources, uh, we're going to be uh, working through uh, local response uh, organizations and charities across the country. And we currently identifying them. Uh, and this part of also the mapping exercise, we, we, which we we conducting. And uh, the, the idea is to support um, uh, individuals and families, uh, uh, families who are going through hardship. Uh, as well as uh, uh, organizations who are basically in, in, in need of a bit of helping hand uh, with some resources. Um, Alhamdulillah, the appeal is, is uh, if I probably share. Um, can I share us if the, oh, we can't, I can't share at the moment. One second, inshallah. Bismillah. Bismillah. Uh, this is basically uh, the appeal, which is under the title uh, COVID-19 uh, Campaign for National Solidarity. And the idea here is not just about raising money, it's about really uh, going beyond charity for all of us. Um, and there is a lot of volunteering, alhamdulillah, happening at the moment on the ground. Uh, there is a lot of local groups responding. So we thought uh, in the top of just raising funds, let's uh, also make sure that we together understand what's happening uh, all, all over the country and connect locally volunteers with uh, what we call it uh, uh, groups and inshallah in the next couple of days a map uh, sorry an application an app will be uh, available uh, the colleagues are at the moment working on it uh, quite fast to, to uh, basically you can see whoever uh, responding across the country to local needs and uh, then people locally can connect with them to support uh, to volunteer and so on. Uh, we have issued a couple of guidelines, one to charities on how to protect their uh, business model, as, as if it's right to say this word, in a way in uh, that Ramadan uh, fits uh, 
um, in, in the heart of this, uh, uh, what we call it, uh, a crisis. And Ramadan for many of our uh, charities, as well as mosques, uh, and of course, our Ummah is, is a, a, an important uh, part of the uh, Islamic calendar. And a lot of those charities are most now challenged uh, uh, due to, uh, they, may, they may face lack of resources. So we're hoping, inshallah, that together we can overcome uh, uh, this issue. Uh, the second part uh, of the or second guide was uh, about how to respond locally uh, and support local organizations by taking into account the different uh, measures um, of uh, uh, what we call it local cooperation and protection, inshallah, for, for whoever getting involved and uh, no, hopefully avoiding any uh, duplication. Uh, we uh, hopefully, inshallah, Monday, uh, which is tomorrow, inshallah, if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will, is we're going to uh, publish the third, third uh, guide, which is uh, uh, for volunteers and volunteering uh, on taking into account different practical uh, advice and issues. Um, and let me just share another Bismillah. Uh, this is just for, for information. This is an icon, inshallah, we, we developed, which will be pushed from uh, uh, hopefully, inshallah, tomorrow that we all can basically utilize. Uh, the whole idea, my dear brothers and sisters, is uh, this initiative is not just another charity. Uh, or fundraising initiative, and this is not something we had in mind, is basically an initiative to, to bring our uh, charities and organizations together, as well as uh, try to, uh, uh, what we call it, uh, be, uh, spread hope, inshallah, and, and give uh, some support to our communities, as well as really stay together and, and work together. And this is the time uh, that we all uh, need, need to do so, inshallah. Fantastic, Jazakallah Khair, Brother Fadi, for the great amount of work that's already gone in that we can, we can see very clearly uh, and for the presentation uh, today. Um, we don't have a, a number of questions there uh, for you at the moment simply because I think your presentation was so clear. So, alhamdulillah, no, I think sure. we have things coming out. So, inshallah, as and when they come out, we'll, we will uh, push them out. No problem. As well. my, my, my final comment, inshallah, I'm trying to share something, but um, my, my uh, phone has uh, is gone <laughs> on freeze. It's basically, uh, uh, one is uh, the national campaign is on launch good. So uh, if you uh, basically, our brothers and sisters are across the country, they would like to know what's happening and see it. It is on launch good under the uh, uh, campaign for national solidarity. And uh, if they require more information, which is the website of the uh, www.muslimcharitiesforum.org.uk, uh, inshallah. Uh, may Allah bless you all, okay. inshallah, protect all of us, inshallah, and give us the strength to overcome this test, inshallah.